The mission of Project LEO is to support and enable the energy transition in Oxfordshire. Without Project LEO, we can't meet the challenge of climate change. We cannot make the speed of transition and allow everybody to plug in those electric cars, allow everybody's home to be properly heated with electricity with the network that we currently have. Project LEO is a perfect fit for the Prospering from the Energy Revolution programme. It brings together smart infrastructure, putting real intelligence at the heart of this local energy system. And it brings together all of the stakeholders who need to deliver new things off that infrastructure. Consumers, the local authority, the business environment, the academics who can help make it a reality. For a long time, the County Council has prided itself on, on being in the lead of innovation, particularly around climate. And LEO is a project that begins to tell us how you run an energy system when it's completely different from the ones we have now. The really hard thing about the transition to zero carbon energy system is that it needs to be completely renewable energy. And that means that we've got to transition to electric bikes, electric trains, electric buses, electric cars. And we also have to transition to heating our homes and businesses with electricity. Without projects like LEO showing what's really possible with smart systems, we're going to slow down our progress to net zero. We've got the opportunity to balance the local resources like the local hydro scheme with what people are doing in their homes and businesses. The other interesting thing is that we'll be able to profit from being a part of this system because your electric car becomes part of the grid. Nuvi is participating in Project LEO with our vehicle to grid chargers. These chargers will discharge the electric vehicle at times when the grid needs energy and our customer is compensated for the energy that they've discharged. For most of Nuvi's customers, they've chosen to go with us in order to reduce their carbon emission by charging their vehicles at periods when there's lower carbon intensity on the grid to help do their part for the environment. LEO is a really important project because it's helping develop market-led solutions to balance out the energy networks. And if we didn't have projects such as Project LEO, we would have an area where we need to pay for more grid reinforcements and grid upgrades that's going to end up costing the end customers a lot more. This UKRI funding has made a step change difference to the low carbon hub. During the course of it, and because of it, we are going to become a medium-sized social enterprise, which I'm very proud about. Uh, and we've also got a much better sense of our future. We know what we've got to do to enable our local people to have that energy future that we're all dreaming of. With a digitalised energy system, we can deliver so much more. Efficient infrastructure, new services to consumers, and just make it easier for people to live net zero lives.